forecast, which is going to be a heck of a lot better than Tuesday was. Yeah, if you're headed to the beach or pool, weather cooperates with those outdoor activities. It's going to be back to the 80s after topping out to yesterday. It's 73 degrees. We were right around 70 for much of the day. The radar, though, showing that rain on the way out here, moving farther away from our area. The skies have been clearing early this morning and quite a bit of rainfall. We did need a good all day soaking like that. It's certainly beneficial to our lawns and gardens. Narragansett picking up two and three quarters of an inch of rain. Wakefield at two and a half inches. Little Compton, New Bedford, all over two inches of rain. Johnston, more than an inch. And a TF Green officially picked up just shy of an inch of rain. Threat trackers low now for today, Thursday, and Friday. While I have an isolated shower in the forecast for today, we don't expect any severe weather. So, again, looking good for um, any activities that you have going on. 69 in Taunton and New Bedford right now. We're back to 70 westerly, 71 Groton, Providence at 71. Working our way out of the 60s, still Gloucester and in Coventry. Back to blue skies at URI as uh, we view the drier conditions here. Block Island under mostly sunny skies. And moving into Providence. We got the sunshine there as well. Humidity is still on the higher side. It's not going to be bad for today, but you'll feel that bit of mugginess in the air still. The drying trend continues, though. There's the back edge of the thicker clouds clearing over eastern Massachusetts. We've got the sunshine, a little bit of mugginess, and an upper level disturbance that'll pinwheel through today. That's going to give us that slight chance of a shower. Now notice end of the morning, not much going on, but you get a little blip of green. We're talking five, 10 minute shower, two o'clock in the afternoon, mostly over areas to our north and east. If you do catch a shower, it's long gone by the time we hit the uh, evening hours and tonight looks mostly clear, more comfortable for sleeping as those overnight lows fall into the lower 60s. 75 at nine o'clock this morning, clearing, drier, muggy. 84 in the afternoon, warm with that mix of sun and clouds, isolated brief shower, west winds at five to 10 miles an hour, and then tonight falling to about 63. So more comfortable with that lighter northwest wind. On the beach, make sure to uh, be careful in the water. There's a moderate risk for rip currents from beaches from Watch Hill to Westport. 78 for the air temperature, water temperature at 71. The bay? Features good visibility. Waves around two feet. High tide was just around uh, seven o'clock this morning. Low tide coming up just past noon today. Here are some of those overnight lows. 58 Pawtucket, 56 Taunton, 60 New Bedford, 62 in Newport. Seven day future cast mid 80s right through the weekend. 84 tomorrow comes with lower humidity. Beautiful day. 79 at the coastline there Gansett. Friday looks great as well. Humidity is back on the rise for the weekend. Mainly dry this weekend. Weakening front coming through here later. Saturday and Saturday night could bring us an isolated thunderstorm in the late afternoon. I'm thinking after three o'clock and it's hit or miss Sundays warm and dry highs in the mid to upper 80s early next week. Full future.